Hello friends, I'm Akash, and a hearty welcome to my YouTube channel. Have you ever wondered why we get hiccups? It gets very annoying very quickly. Plus, it happens so randomly. So, why do we get hiccups? Before we get into details, we should know how our breathing mechanism works. This is the basics to understanding why we get hiccups. As you all know, the lungs are the primary organs of our respiratory system. Below the lungs is a dome-shaped muscle called the diaphragm, which separates the chest from the abdomen and drives the respiration process. Normally, when we breathe in, the diaphragm contracts and increases the space surrounding the lungs for expansion, which take in air containing oxygen. When we breathe out, the diaphragm expands, taking back that space, and their lungs will come back to the resting position, releasing carbon dioxide. Now, when we breathe in and out normally, you take it for granted, usually, and you can actually feel when you try it. It's smooth and relaxed. Try to feel it right now. Pretty smooth, right? But sometimes the diaphragm gets irritated and makes sudden involuntary expansions out of nowhere, contracting the lungs, quickly forcing up air through your throat, almost immediately closing your vocal cord, creating that familiar sound. And these are called hiccups. Why do we get hiccups though? What causes the diaphragm to get irritated? I mean, usually a round of hiccups is often followed by the stimuli that stretch the stomach, say by eating or drinking too fast, or like when we are experiencing intense emotions like crying or feeling anxiety. And scientists have not clearly figured out why exactly we get hiccups. I mean, they, may, they might probably serve a function that we don't know about yet, or they might just be a byproduct of our evolution. But for most of us though, hiccups stop within a few minutes. How do we stop these hiccups? Cleveland Clinic recommends some of the home remedies, like drinking water, eating sugar, or just straight up holding your breath for as long as you can. But some people also use, say, the scare trick to stop hiccups. In the US, there are at least three medications that can help stop these hiccups. But scientists do not know the mechanism of how these medications work to stop hiccups. So comment down below if you ever have experienced bad hiccups and what you did to stop them. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you like my videos, then make sure to subscribe and don't forget to click the bell icon so you don't miss my new videos every time I upload. Once again, thanks so much for watching. Love you, Akash.